Eric's a Spice Channel advocate. Am I correct? That's right. I what do you like about Spice, thing. Mr. Wilson? The nudity. What don't you like about Spice, Mr. Wilson? The soundtracks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> crazy day. It was probably the fourth time we had been given our last strike. And they told us that we had one more incident. We were going to be sent home. Louis was there, so I got a call before the show started that Louis has been biting people. So I went to find Louis, found Brad with Louis. They started drinking early in the morning. They gave him kegs of beer. Boys found the kegs and kind of set up shop right there around the kegs. And by mid-afternoon, they were pretty well lit up. Since I was waiting at that liquor store for the ounces of freedom, and I made my heart, and I know. getting wet all day. They've been spraying water on a big open field. But it was a big muddy area and there was straw that they tried to put down but it didn't really work too good because there was a lot of thick powdery dirt that turned into thick mud. The whole time Brad or Bud screaming at me, take the guitar away from Brad, he's not playing it anyway, give it to Dan, you know. Everyone was having a good time and they started like getting each other muddy. Then a couple people threw a couple of the wads, the adobe looking hay mud <laughs> combination up onto the stage and Eric started it off because he grabbed a hunk of it and threw it back and then that, that sort of goes a melee after that. <laughs> Oh, 
He had to take our guitar apart and you know, our road tech guy. Yeah. Take them apart, get all the mud off them. And I guess everybody else's road techs had to do the same. Remember how fucked up Brad was during that show? Not especially. <laughs> you don't remember Bud beating him up? Well, you know, this happened quite frequent, so <laughs> yeah. it all just got pretty blurred out, you know, over the years. We might not be playing tomorrow. Kevin's so fucking hot right now, he wants us to leave. He's thinking about flying us home right now. It might be better if we fucking get to say it, but it might be better if we just fucking hook up with him, maybe see if we can hook up from Seattle down by the last three shows. Fuck it. Let Brad dry out a little bit and fucking get the invincibility fucking trip off his shoulder. So I'm telling me he's kicking me out of the back because I'm hitting him. And he's fucking coming up trying to sucker punch my ass. He's all calling me a fucking pussy because I want to go home because my ribs are broken and I didn't get no medical attention by that time. You know? And I'm telling him, hold the fuck, go home. I'm fucking hurting. I can't breathe. Uh -huh. Oh, you pussy, you pussy. I'm just going to take a shower. I'm going to blow you all away. Yeah. I'm gonna get my fucking gun, shoot gun. Turn around. Would it be the same without it? No. <laughs> the keg's still The keg's gone, but uh, inside the green roof they were still serving even after the band was done, so. I'd say it's pretty much still on. Ready, People, let me tell you about my amp head. It's so. Fat in the shaft, I pull it out, it gets real red. People, let me tell you about my AM head. It's my tuna can pride joy. They suck me off, they yell, oh boy. People, let me tell you about my AM head. Welcome to uh, Buzzkill 101, you bunch of degenerates. You are here for one reason and one reason only. You guys are permanent bum outs, okay? Permanent. What I mean is forever eternal. You are a bum out. Which means you guys are not key. Key is good. When you say not key, it's not good. I would like to uh, share a little story about what I feel is permanently key. Okay. That is the day I got my first little black box for scrambling cable stations. Four spice channels. Okay. Unplug my phone for three days. A couple packages of hot dogs, a couple of cases of beer, about 15 boxes of Kleenex. That was key. It's key. Dry bowl is key. Onion butt key. Starting style box key. Duraflame is key. Benefits are not key. Do you want to know why benefits are not key? How much of a bum out is it when you're rolling like in somebody's minivan, right? And the dad just cranks a big vicious dry Olympia benefit. Just brrrr. And the fog just comes out, and you're like in the mountains, and the guy's got this heater going. Not key.